What's up guys, it's Gun Scorch here, and today you guys, I got a brand new GTA video. Uh, continuing with our mini-series here. Uh, some man in the comments section uh, said not to waste my money on this, because it's... Uh, All-wheel drive and doesn't really like to drift. So that just that that really just made me want to buy it even more. So uh VI Sixer. He's got one too. I wonder if he wants to come on the drift course. <laughs> Alright, so apparently this man's bad at drifting, but he's gonna go change some things and then we'll go drift with him, so. Uh, I guess story time in the meantime. Yeah, so I just got done fighting three oppressors. The final score was, uh, let me see, I sent it to a friend of mine. It was... One guy, it was 19 to 0, I had 0. Uh, another guy was 23 to 0, I had 0. And the other guy was 25 to 1, and I had 1. So... Yeah. Yeah, they didn't let me get in my vehicle at all. It was spawn kill, spawn kill. Alright, so we're gonna go drifting with this man. First thing I notice it being all-wheel drive. Uh, front doesn't really like to uh, grip to the ground and slide. Doesn't like the handbrake uh, high revving either. So we'll kind of have to make do with it just sliding. Yes, I did try to make this as close to uh, Paul Walker's Eclipse in Fast and Furious 1 as, uh, as possible. Our man's falling a little behind here. Oh, man, he's going out. Keep coming back, though. Keep coming back. Let's see what the sun can do. Really likes to drift, and that not having the high rev really kind of screws us a little. to regain traction as fast as possible. trying to save it from uh, overturning, but that kind of pulls me out of the drift right away. So, I don't know, maybe we'll try to leave it in. Yeah, I don't know, about, about the best we're going to get out of this, if I'm being honest. And then money hopped.
Actually, that might be the best. I'll wait up here for a man to catch up. Alright, good. Got that one a little wide. He seems to be able to drift it. Maybe it's the suspension. Maybe I just gotta stance the wheels. The stance wheel didn't look like his car though, so. Oh, <laughs> that man gotta hit a car. I kinda hit a car. It does grip right off the bat, so. I mean, maybe, maybe it would be a better grip vehicle. Parking garage test right now. It really does. Like if you if you try to save it and turn out of the drift, it really just the front tires grip and pull the whole car out. So it's pretty much you you, you can't really try to save the car. Let's try the parking garage test. Uh, that hitbox is a little weird. Oh, no, I really don't like the slide. Oh, I can start to feel a double clutch a little bit. I like that, uh, that drifting in there. Alright, now we got cops on us, so. Over just to get out of the way of the cops. really does like to grip to the ground, man. This doesn't like to drift. Stop whatever you're doing. Do you not clearly see what we're doing? We doing them figure eights. I don't know, man. Maybe I should stand the wheels. Right, we'll go to the bigger circuit. See how she handles over there. And then we'll go do the. Uh... Oh, Benny's drift test, and then, then we... maybe I'll go stance the wheels. And... Maybe try the bigger one. Oh god, yeah, this is garbage. See, I can't get that over rev, so I can't spin the tires or get any sort of power through the turn. Maybe I try to take it really wide. 
worked. Well, that worked wonderfully. Thank you, Mr. Stromberg. I appreciate it. Now I gotta go call my car, which is gonna make the video longer. MMI. We really, expect I should do, the unexpected. Really, I should do these in solo sure. sessions, but meh. Then we don't get random people in here to come drift with us. Car oh, I'm a moron. I just called her from Moors, and I thought I called him. I called. I thought I thought I called the mechanic for a sec. I was like, wait a minute. I was like, where's my car at? There it is. All right, so we'll go try Benny's now. Benny's, I might need to set a waypoint too. I hate the handbrake does like nothing. That was not bad. We really just need massive amounts of speed. Oh, and no cars. Oh man, pick up pick up some speed. And light pole. You can kinda of, you can you can really see it when we uh when we were sliding backwards back there. I was trying to go forward. Dude the amount that I picked up the front end was ridiculous. Could get a little bit out of this. It's not too bad speed wise. Once you eventually get it up to speed. And I suppose you could do some. Wider drifts if you're going fast enough. Like, uh, let's see, where's a wide drift? Go up here around this bend. Okay, now we gotta back up and get some more speed. Thanks, Mr. Truck Driver, you're making the video even longer. People stop shooting. So I don't know why sometimes it overrides and sometimes it doesn't. And the times I want it to overrev, it doesn't. I guess as long as you don't throw the back end too far, like if you only throw it a little bit, it kind of does it. I guess if you throw it sideways, um, you're kind of you're creating more friction and traction with the road, so it slows you down more than just a slight drift. Right, well, let's max stance the wheels and then go test out that uh, figure Here for the magic again. touch. 
and on our way, we'll try some uh, wider drifts. So we'll take the long Should way around. Be better than ever. Nope, nope. Suspension, that's what it is. Oop. We'll just slam it. Not to worry, we'll just slam it. Oh, don't worry about that bumper clipping into the ground. God, dude, that is, that looks horrible. That is so lowered. Well, it's not too bad if you make wider turns, but short turns, it's just garbage because it slows down too much. All that and the tires are clipping through the fender now. Still don't want to do it on that. My boy VI Sixer kind of disappeared. Eyes chilling in the corner. I guess it's not a corner, it's the middle of the street, but I don't really worry about that. Don't worry about the details. I should be doing period. Oh god. It's like when you're driving a manual and you forget to downshift. So you're trying to start off from a dead stop in sixth gear. Well, depending on how many gears you got. Yeah, I might have to go with the comments on this one. <laughs> Pretty doo doo. Let's try a wider drift again. If anything, it drifts more with no suspension on. See over the steering wheel. Seat nodes are a little low. Over yeah. Evan, almost 140, it looks like. So, all in all, not too bad on speed. Even if it only really goes like 130 constantly, what brings you like in today? Consistently, then I'd still keep up with most sports cars, supercars. Better than new. All right, we'll try one more drift. I 
mean, without the stance tires, I feel like the car has less grip. So it makes it easier to drift. So. I don't know, guys. Also, I do know some rear wheel drive cars like the Supra in here that you can throw that thing all you want into uh, over rev and it goes about this speed when it's over revving. Or even that's too fast. It's more like about this fast ish. When it's over ready. Yeah, yeah, that's a good spot to stop it. Um, you can throw it into drifts, uh, but it being all wheel drive and stuff, it just sucks. I feel like if you could over rev it, it'd do a lot better. But really, any all-wheel drive, just GTA's mechanics don't like it to drift. I mean, seeing how it's all-wheel drive, it's more of meant to uh, grip to the road. But, yeah. Um, I'm going to give it a uh, 3 out of 10. I think a 3 out of 10 is fair, just because really it doesn't drift, but you can throw it into some drifts. It's not too bad on the wider ones, so I think a 3 out of 10 is fair. Um, so yeah, per usual, don't know what I'm doing next. Uh, if I get some suggestions in the comments, I'll probably end up doing those. Um, so, yeah. People are getting trolled by an oppressor mark too. I might have to go take care of it. And then start another 3v1 and die a bunch of times. Yeah. I thought there was a man, uh, VA Sixer. But, uh. But yeah. Pretty usual. Not, don't know what car I'm doing next, but, uh. Yeah, 3 out of 10. I'm gonna give it a 3 out of 10. That's going to be it for this one. See you in the next one. Peace out.